Oketupu. I represent an area of Woji River Federal Constituency from Enugu State. Mr. Speaker, I want to associate with this motion basically because this republic trends on the fact that we follow the rule of law and not the rule of men. And I know that in the rule of law, prior to any action being taken, you must show cause of action. What essentially we are then looking for in Gojo's house? Why was this not made known to him? Even when you obtain a search warrant, you ordinarily have to inform the person whom you've come to search his house. But unfortunately, and incidental in this case, they invaded his house. Senator Goje was here in parliament doing his work, and they were there for four hours. What was wrong getting him to even follow them to search his house? And they were busy breaking every door. And unfortunately, we have, begin, we have begun or we now feel that this type of action is normal. We are beginning to think that it is normal to invade somebody's house. It could be Goje today. It could be another person tomorrow. And as a matter of fact, when Hitler invaded, when Hitler was causing problems in Germany, people thought it was the Christians, and it's not me. The next, you thought it was the Jews. It was not them only. He proceeded, invaded Poland. People thought it was the Polish. He invaded Russia. And next, he was in the UK and France. And suddenly we were all in a world war. This republic must continue to encourage a situation where our law enforcement agents do their job in a law-abiding manner. Our laws doesn't anticipate ambush. You don't ambush a person and invade his house, break his toilet, tear his bed, uh, pull up his sock away, and lift his bed, invade the wife's bedroom, invade the, uh, the daughter's bedroom. Is this a wasteful blowing activity? Or is it something based on human intelligence? Or is it based on an action that the intelligence community has gathered some evidence that he has committed a crime and they are following? If that is the case, we want to know. If it is a matter of wasted blowing, we might create, we might want to cure one, def one defect and we create another. You have his daughters or his children coming back from overseas carrying a lot of briefcases and they think that somebody is bringing a lot of dollars and you invade somebody's house. We should not allow it to happen. I don't want to believe, Mr. Speaker, honorable colleagues, that our judiciary has been conquered. That with the invasion of various justices' places that they have called the judiciary. And now, just like Hitler did, they proceeded to the legislature. We cannot allow that to happen. And we are the watchdogs of this, this republic, this particular democracy. And we must subject to question anything that is on toward that is done by our law enforcement agents. I don't want to also believe because we asked, they said it's not EFCC. We asked, they said it's not ICPC, that it is the police. I do not want to believe that our law enforcement agents are into an undue competition of who will go and discover billions or millions of dollars anywhere. Something has been found in Lagos, right? We don't even know the owner yet. Somebody has been, something has been found in, in, uh, in, in Kaduna. 
We don't know the owner yet. Goje's house has been invaded. We don't know the reason for the invasion. We don't know the people who own these billions of dollars and naira. And this is an, an action that should be based on actionable intelligence. We're just busy invading people. If you see boxes, you go and invade. If you see, uh, just by way, this, this type of bristle blowing and this type of effort should be driven by intelligence. If it is not, the intelligence community should get their acts together. And now we are aware that the budget process has been aborted. The CDs and documents relating to the budget has been cutted away. I know this parliament was trying to lay the budget by yesterday or today. But now, it cannot be laid because the process has been aborted by an advertent or inadvertent action of the intelligence community, and in this case, particularly the police. So I subscribe to this motion. We should investigate it and let this be the last. Thank you very much.